Maine's top health officials are concerned gatherings on Super Bowl Sunday could turn into super spreader events. With COVID-19 guidelines in mind, for most, celebrations will look different this year. New Center Maine's Jackie Mundry explains. Tom Brady and the Bucks are getting ready to take on Patrick Mahomes and the Chiefs on Sunday night, but Governor Janet Mills and CDC Director Dr. Narav Shah say it's best to watch the big game safely at home. For the folks here at Binghas and Yarmouth, that means a lot of takeout. We still are expecting a tremendous amount of takeout, but only two of our three dining rooms are open. For those looking to dine in, some businesses will be open for that, like Rigby Yard in Portland. Uh, we're not doing a Super Bowl party. What we're doing is we're reserving tables for a Super Bowl seating. Governor Mills says it appears the state has rounded the corner on the post-holiday COVID-19 spike, but fear celebrations could set Maine off the right track. I don't know anybody, for instance, who doesn't love a Super Bowl party. She says maintaining social distance will not only keep you safe, but it will ease the burden of health care workers. It's a small inconvenience, a small sacrifice to make for a lot of good reasons. CDC Director Dr. Narav Shah echoes that sentiment, adding that even small gatherings can spread COVID-19. Uh, there is a concern that Super Bowl events could turn into transmission events. While Super Bowl celebrations will look different, there will be a familiar component that many New Englanders will cling to, watching TB12 in the big game. Most of us have an affinity for Tom Brady, so we're certainly rooting for the Bucks this year. I think I gotta go with Brady. I think I gotta root for Brady. Let's all make sure we're alive and well next year to watch Tom Brady's 11th appearance at the Super Bowl. Governor Mills adds that for the bars and restaurants that are open on Sunday night, they are still required to follow CDC guidelines. In Yarmouth, Jackie Mundry, News Center, Maine.